What's good, guys? It's your boy, Eat Bike Buddy here. Guys, what's going on? A little quick run. I'm going to talk about dystopianbikes.com, my business. Let you guys know that is officially my business. And we have some great things in store. So, come with me on this quick little run. And like always, please do enjoy the ride. I try to get smacked by a truck. Not today. Yeah, so guys, dystopianbikes.com. Great place. Right now, we only have two bikes, the Oxy V8 stock, along with the Tosi VE7 stock. Guys, we're going to have some great new bikes coming, especially this fall. So please, please stay tuned to that. Also, we'll be having a, a program coming up, guys. Uh, upgrade My Ride program which will have a membership, nothing crazy, but that membership would include on a month to month basis, free parts, free upgraded parts. Right now it's in concept mode, but I'm telling you it is in the making. Guys, what other business you know out there has a membership program that gives you free parts every month that you can choose. I mean, real parts, like we're talking $400 DNM forks, KKE forks, upgraded motor, upgraded battery. We're talking about real power here. What's going on here? We're talking about real power. Also, I will be having a clearance sale on the Oak CV8. Should be coming up in about two weeks. The Oak CV8 will be the cheapest on my website that you can find it anywhere else. And I will do a price match. Just gotta make room for our new bikes coming in. All right, time to ride. We'll be back after these messages. Oh, we could have made that. Good brakes, good brakes. Guys, I love these damn brakes. These Samir brakes are amazing. I'm getting them on the Tosi VE7. You guys, you guys are missing out. I tell you guys, get these brakes. If you upgrade your vehicle, you know, to 3,000 watts or, or more. That's when these, these brakes are needed. Otherwise, you don't have to get them. I mean, we got a stock motor. Just get some regular hydraulic brakes, not even four piston. If you're upgrading that motor to, I say, even 2,000 watts or more, guys, get yourself some decent four piston brakes. I recommend McGurk. 
I had no problem with them. They're great. But at the end of the day, they are high profile mountain bike brakes. These bikes right here, they, I mean, at the end of the day, they still are freaking bike brakes, but they had in mind, you know, e bikes when they made them. Specifically. So, you know. For that reason, these, these brakes are pretty damn sufficient. They're exact replica of the whole brakes. I mean, exact replica. They use the same brake pads and all. Yeah, guys, we have great things coming to Dodge Dystopian Bikes. Great things, great things. Great bikes, great new bikes. And you guys know my theme. I love cafe racers. So we will be sticking to the cafe racer theme, but we will be having some high-profile uh, Suron like dirt bikes as well. So stay tuned for that as well. Guys, give me a second. I shall return. I'll be right back. It's your boy, Eat Bike Boogie, yeah? All right, guys, we're back here. We are back. Guys, I love this Oxy V8, 72 volts modified. She's a beast. She is a beast. Guys, let's talk about customer service, right? So in terms of Right, ordering a bike from dystopianbikes.com versus like Amazon, Alibaba, AliExpress. It's no customer service, right? And the customer service you do get is very limited, right? So that's what we will be focusing on. Customer service. Not only do you get a one-year warranty with the bike, like if anything happens and it's like obviously, you know, shipment's fault, our fault, or just like, you know, manufacturer's fault, we're sending you another bike. Send us that bike back. We're paying for the shipping. And we're sending you another bike. It's as simple as that. Simple as that. If you're having any problems with the bike, you get on the phone with me or one of my agents. You know, uh, whatever time it is. Uh, obviously a respectable time. And we'll get on a video conference call with you to fix your issue. If it's that bad, you know. If it can't be fixed on the call. Customer service is very important, guys. I feel like, uh, you know, there's a lot of people who don't know about e-bikes but want one. And it's a lot of things that they need to know. And there are people out there that are, excuse my language, they're, they're a-holes, you know? Especially on, on group chats. Not my group chat. I mean, especially on group forums. Not my group forum, thank gosh. Because, you know, that's not tolerated there. The disrespect. People come here to learn. Not to be disrespected when asking how to upgrade their e-bike. Like, that's why... I made the daggone group. Anyway, customer service is very important. So I feel like uh, that's one thing that uh, <clears throat> Dystopian Bikes will be focusing on. It's customer service. Making sure that everybody is satisfied. So that's, that's you know, very important, I feel like. I feel like that's very important. When you go into these businesses... Not only that, you know, I look at it from an aspect, from a point of view of uh, being a customer myself, because, you know, I am. Um, and one thing that's important to me is something's wrong with the bike. I like to be able to call the, you know, the people who I got the bike from and ask them, hey, what's going on? And I expect answers quickly. <laughs> you know, so, yeah, just a little rundown, you know, with dystopianbikes.com on uh, customer service and what's to come now guys we're about to shimmy on back so please do like always 
Enjoy the ride. New York City has a rat infestation problem right now. And I mean, it is bad. It is smash ratted twoies on every freaking block. It's disgusting. I like ratatouilles, but you know, a lot of people don't like rats. They got bad names. I used to have so many pet rodents, lizards, snakes, you name it, man. Freaking birds. I had them all, I had them all. But New York City rats, they're, they're a different breed of uh, animal that needs to be tamed quickly. But they're smashed all over the damn streets. Man, bro, I hate that bump. I hate it. That's one thing about the Oxy. No damn back suspension. Now, they made a V8 Pro, guys. I'm pretty sure you guys have heard about it, right? So. I have the opportunity of getting that bike and reviewing it. Also putting it on dystopianbikes.com but it's one thing I don't like about that bike it's 24 inch tires I'm not happy about that let me know how you guys feel about that in the comments it's the same Oxy bike but it has double suspension double hydraulic suspension amazing yo prolific if you see this video that was what that guy was talking about double hydraulics Let's go. rain this rain sucks I feel like I need a better front light. Like, this light is good. It's just, I don't want to blind people, but I need to see. And I think I'm going blind. I'm almost 40 years old. Yes, I am a big damn kid. People always say, oh, look at this grown ass man on a, on a chill child's bike. It's ain't a child's bike, damn it. <clears throat> it's a grown child's bike. You gotta be correct about it, at least. Sheesh. It's a grown man child's bike.
Roads are a little slick. It's all right though. It's all right though. It's better for burnouts that I don't do. I don't know. People like doing burnouts. I like saving my tires. Sorry for anybody who was behind me with that speed ticket. I mean, speed uh, camera. Pretty sure they won't get the ticket. They be looking pissed off. Guys, like always, you know, if you stay tuned for the entire video, as always, you guys are the real VIPs here. It's your boy, Eat Bike Boogie here. I love all of you. Stay tuned. <laughs>